For almost eight years, this wheelchair has been part of Andrew Merriweather's life. In 2006, he was beaten up by a group of young men after a night of partying. His injuries serious, but his spirit not crushed. I could blame everyone and everything for the, the situation that I found myself in, or I could make the best of the situation that I was in and look for different therapies and teams of therapists that shared my vision to try to progress to the best that I could possibly be in the new body that I found myself in. Thanks to an exobionic walking suit, Merriweather is back on his own two feet and for the past 12 months has been learning how to walk again. His lower body is still too weak to support his weight, so the suit keeps him upright. Small computer-operated motors help move his legs. But it's not a cheap option. At a cost of 800,000 rand for this second-hand suit, paid for with the help of donations. First time you get in the suit and you back into eye level with the people, it feels like you're entering the world again. I mean, if the suit does nothing medically, just psychologically, it's worth it. It's incredible to feel like, like you're part of the world again. It's quite a new field, this um, people with spinal cord injuries that I've been involved in. But um, seeing Andrew before, like video footage of, of when he arrived here in the lab to um, what he's like now and the functional ability that he has, um, it's amazing. Since he was fitted with the suit, Merriweather has participated in fun walks. But his ultimate test is yet to come when he plans to walk his fiance down the aisle early next year. Lester Kivitt, Cape Town. No more. ENCA.com.